This is Twit. We had talked uh, last week about a weird memory leak that people were reporting in um, Monterey, Mac OS uh, Moder 11. What is it? 11 1? What is it? What is Monterey? 13? 13, 13 now? No, 12. 12. Is it 12 point something? I so think confusing. Now? Anyway, uh, yeah, 12.0.1. 12 12.0.1, right. 0 .1, You're yeah. right, yeah. Uh, Mac OS Monterey. Uh, do we call it Mac OS 12 now? Just Mac OS. Well, Apple no frowns on that. They just want the Monterey. They okay. just, the numbers are all hidden. You know, people don't like numbers. It scares we don't know them. what it is. So the memory <laughs> leak, according to the Eclectic Light Company, has been discovered. You won't believe this. And uh, by the way, I had the memory leak, and I was doing this. So maybe I actually stopped using uh, Firefox because it was using so much memory on my M1 yeah. Pro. Uh, started using Safari again. The cause has been isolated <laughs> to a uh, setting in the accessibility preference pane. If you change your pointer size or you use the brand new custom outline and fill colors, uh, there is apparently a pointer uh, a memory leak in the pointer. The, the leak appears to occur when the pointer type changes from, for instance, the standard arrow to an I beam for the insertion of text. Uh, and uh, apparently the memory used by the previous pointer isn't freed if you're using a custom pointer. Oh, Every app with an interface in which the pointer can change type will leak until this bug is fixed in Monterey. The fix, it was which I mail and notes that people have been complaining about, and those are very those those switch for the text insertion. Yes, anything with a text field, right? Yeah. Uh, the fix is to go into the accessibility setting, settings, <laughs> click the pointer tab, and turn everything off. Set it back to normal, which I did. And okay, sadly, because I what had you changed it to, Leo? A big pointer. Just out of curiosity. Oh, okay. I can't, it, it's it, you know I don't really need it because I switched it back and it's fine, but. Uh, especially on the on the laptop, but I just got used to it, and I think it was because on my on my big iMac Pro, I would lose the pointer regularly. I had three screens, so the pointer could be here, it could be there, it could be there. Did you shake it? Because it gets huge when you shake I, it. I turned on the shake feature, but I just thought, you know, I'm going to make the pointer big. And uh, in fact, I complained for a while that I couldn't, and then somebody said, "You idiot! It's inaccessibility." Oh, duh. <laughs> so I made the pointer big, and then I just got used to doing that every time. And now I guess I won't. Uh, Apple could fix it. I mean, yeah, yeah. I, and it absolutely, absolutely did see this uh, happening. It, it was a Firefox was a particular problem. Uh, so much so that you might even see that your Mac has run out of application memory error, which I did yeah. see on my brand new M1 Pro. Uh, so, anyway, there you go. Thank you to the Eclectic Light Company. And uh, they seem to have solved that. And now Apple, now it's on on Apple to fix it. And that's our entire show for the day because I got nothing. Thanks, everybody. <laughs> I got Thanks, really, everybody. It is the typical very, very slow period between Apple product releases.